What's up puzzle gang? Welcome back to another Puzzle Wonder video. Today we're gonna solve the Pentomino Jigsaw puzzle. The goal of this puzzle is to assemble a jigsaw, square, rectangle, whatever angle, from the pieces you have. But the pieces are not the regular pieces you see in a supermarket or in Walmart. They are pieces that evil people designed to make us suffer. So the pieces are Pentominoes with jigsaw in-cuts in them. This is a, an extremely evil idea. This was designed by Thomas Vanio and made by Nothing Yet Designs and if you want to get this puzzle yourself you can check the link in the video description. And now let's seal the deal that if I get to solve this puzzle you subscribe to this channel and like this video. You get it? Seal the deal. Keep watching because I'm gonna try it right now and hopefully I succeed because ah uh, yeah it looks pretty difficult. Starting the timer. Okay, so this is probably on the side, on one of the sides, not sure which of the sides I will need to decide. This actually looks like this is the place made for it. The question is, how big will the square be? Will it be 5x5, 6x6, 7x7? Every square you see here is one voxel and because every one of the pieces are 5 voxels, these are called pentominoes. Most likely this will be a 6x10 because we have 12 pieces this one won't fit here because then we're gonna go there let's see what i can put here that will work okay but i see what's the, uh, the difficulty here i see it so this is probably not here let's see what can be in the corners this can be in the corner right this can be on a corner this can be in a kind of corner also this can be in the corner. So let's say these are our corners. Then let's say this is like the six. This can be here, right? And then we have this one. We've got this one here. Okay, we can try and expand from here. And let's see if it works, if it works well, if it does not work well. Actually it looks pretty promising to me. And I think I want to expand on this direction but then here kind of looks impossible right maybe i underestimated it maybe i did maybe this should be here actually and then i can fit this one nope i cannot fit it there okay logic is uh leaving me logic does not want to help me let's try to maybe okay this works but also this can work pretty well okay that might solve it that can solve this problem but then I have more problems to solve this may not be here but this okay look at that now we've got a corner here we've got a corner this looks pretty legit so here I have one more voxel to put because as we said we need it to be 6 by 10 this is impossible. Yes, this is a problem. There's not a lot of pieces that I can fit here that will work well. So only this works for me, actually. What if this is the upper corner and then we can expand here? Let's try this theory. And this allows me to continue. The question is if it has to be solid. Because if it does, no, it, it probably has to be solid. I will check. Let's use the internet now. Okay, so it says approximate size 4 times 6. Actually, that's a big hint. So, 6 by 10 will not fit it probably. It's actually interesting. I'm considering maybe building it 5 times 12. If this will work. 6 by 10 is the size, I think. It should be as a normal jigsaw. So, it should be a solid block. This can fit here. And if we expand there, then it will make sense. Also here I can fit one square. What should I do? If this is not here, what if this... This can be here actually. This can go here. Mm. This can go here, like that. And then continue there, but then we'll get some wasted corners. What if this one is not here? What if there's another piece that should fit there? What if this is it? Maybe like that. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. 
Now this could work, but then this one won't be here. Maybe instead this one can be here, but then I have this missing. Ah, it's very cryptic this whole puzzle because there's so many ways to fit it all and yeah, it's tricky. Six by ten, for sure. I can try different assumptions, a lot of different assumptions actually. So if I fit these two like that, that means I have nine here, and I have one more here to put in the corner. Now this won't fit here. Neither. Oh, this can fit here. Let's see if I can expand on that. And if not, I will try another piece. Yeah, I don't think anything can be there. And also this cannot be like that. What if I flip this piece? That's an option, right? I didn't think of that, now I did. Um, let's try this. Any piece? No, I can see it from the get-go that this is not it. Ooh, that is close, that is close. Also, this is impossible, sadly. What if? This would actually be here, and I will try to expand on this. So if this is the case, then the piece that can fit here is, no, it cannot, this also cannot, so this is not here. So I would guess that this piece should be in, in the side. And then there's not a lot of options of pieces that can fit here actually. So one of the options is this one. So this is the second corner. And if this is the case, then I will need to find something. For example, this piece here can fit. So this is not here. What if I put this piece here? Then I might have a chance to fit a piece here, but then I, I need a T piece, which unfortunately will not help me. Also, this won't help me either so this is not an option what if I put this piece here for example I can expand from that but it's actually not possible how about this also not possible no 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 uh, this is the only possibility I see to be honest like what can fit here now nothing right so this is impossible. What if I take this piece? No, not possible. This piece? No. No, not this one. Not this one. This one can work. No, it actually cannot. So this one is not here. What about this piece? No. What about this one? Also no. What about this one? No, impossible. I'm not sure this is on the side now, actually. So let's put it aside and let's start with this. Let's assume this is one of the corners. Again, I'm kind of moving in circles a little bit, but I guess once I grasp it, once I get this thing going, then it will be a bit easier. Maybe this piece will, can, will then go here, but then it's actually a bit tricky for the last pieces to go here. So. Maybe this one is not here. This one cannot be here either. This can fit here quite well. This then can fit here, but will it work? I think it will. I can then expand like that. Now I need to find something to fit in this place and this one will not fit, but this can and then there's empty space. So instead, I can put this one, but then I have seven here, uh, which means I will need to expand here. Let's see if there's another way to expand. No, I guess not. So let's say this is the correct way to assemble it. Now I need something to fit inside here. And actually this works well and I can fit this piece. Oh man, oh man, I think, I think we've got this going. I think we've got this rolling, okay. Okay, now I see that we have uh, a chance to win this puzzle. Let's put
put this here. This is the only one that can fit here. And then, so this can fit here, but I'm not sure this would be correct. Maybe there's another piece that can fit here. Hopefully there is, maybe this one. And then I can take this here. Okay, okay. Now I've got, I've got some hopes now. Okay, good, good. Uh, next piece, this is the only one that can fit here. And I think, guys, I think we have solved this puzzle. That was difficult. Let's go, that took us 20, three minutes super cool puzzle very unusual and not your regular packing puzzle since you don't have a place to pack it but still we managed to do it i like it when puzzles that seem easy and seem like i've got them in my small pocket are actually not that easy and this is a very nice twist on the pentomino concept which was very fun to solve i hope you guys enjoyed it and I know you guys enjoyed it it was a pretty cool puzzle and because you did please leave a like and subscribe to this channel for more puzzle videos and I'll see you guys in the next video